Hi, this is Ryan of Happy Healthy Vegan. In this episode, boy, do I have a great secret I learned when I was shopping for bananas at Whole Foods recently. But first, let's kind of recap what happens when we all go shopping for bananas at a market. You know what it's like, they are never ripe. Have you noticed that? When was the last time you went to a major market and picked up a ripe banana, a properly ripened banana? We're not talking about a banana that's solid yellow. That's lucky, because most of the time, when you go to the markets, they're green. They're about five to six days away from being edible, assuming you take them home and ripen them properly. If you're really lucky, you know, they're greenish yellow or, or all yellow, but rarely, I mean, not rarely, never do you get a properly ripened banana, like something like this, with all its nice spots on it. You know, this is what a ripened banana is, guys. Not a solid yellow banana. It's still too starchy. The sweetness hasn't come out until you got something like this with spots all over it. You never see this in the stores. Well, when I was at Whole Foods, I, I, I was at a, a part, you know, it's a, it's a ripening cycle. You guys know if you're buying boxes of bananas every week, you get new ones, old ones are going out. So I had a box that was pretty much ready to go, and that's my, my rhythm. When I break open a new box, I go buy, I go to the store to get another box. So I was um, wanting to get a box where they were, you know, what I'm expecting, kind of greenish yellow. But the guy brought out from the back this ripened box of bananas, kind of like what I showed you there. Uh, maybe more like this though, where they're um, not fully spotted. Ooh, I guess this is riper than I thought one, just, they just fell off there. But they're partially spotted. Uh, but I'm going, I've ne I told the guy, I've never seen bananas that ripe ever out on the, on the store, you know, out where, you know, you can pick them and, you know, put them in your basket. And they let me on a little secret here. They said that they are not allowed to put bananas that have any spots on them. The most ripe they can ever stick out on the floor is a yellow banana. That's their policy. If the banana has spots on it, or if a box of banana has spots on it, like in the case with the box they brought to me, it cannot go out on the floor. It's against store policy. You know, I might have been able to, I could have bought that because, you know, I was just finagling with them with what they had in stock in the back. But again, that box never would have made it to the store floor. And that just explains so much to me why we never see ripe bananas. And I don't think that's a, a policy exclusive for Whole Foods. It must be a common practice in the major supermarket industry. Think about it. When was the last time you went to the market and saw ripe bananas? You don't. And I think this is ludicrous because the, these kinds of bananas I'm showing you here are just minimal spotty and they're still a few days away from being at their peak. So they're not gonna like spoil or anything like that. So I think this is absolutely ludicrous how people cannot go to the market, especially people like us who eat a ton of fruit, we can't go to the market and buy some food that's properly ready to eat. I mean, this is silly. It's like, you know, people that buy meat, they can go and buy meat and then it's ready to eat. They take it home, they fry it up or whatever you do to it and it's ready. We can't do that with bananas. You just can't get a banana, peel it and eat it unless you want to eat some weird green starchy banana. So um, I think this is absolutely nuts and I don't know what we can do to change it. So post your questions and comments down below there, guys. And uh, are you shocked by this too? Do you find this to be completely ridiculous? And share your ideas down there too. What can we do? Is this a good idea that we talk to our, our produce managers and let them know that there is a demand for people that want bananas now, not five days from now or whatever? You know, why are we at a disadvantage? Because we choose to eat good fruit, but they won't put it out there for us. Um, and if you um, haven't already, subscribe up above for more from Angie and I. Angie's got some interesting episodes in the works, and we have some work together coming out soon, too. So until then, guys, remember to, as best you can, get some ripe bananas and keep it carved, guys. Keep it carved. It's a slide of hand, conjurous trick.